I learned the pain cave set from Cal Dietz, strength coach over at the University of Minnesota and the author of triphasic training. So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna take your one rep max on the bench press, multiply that by, by 90%, by 0.9, write that number down. From there, you're gonna do that by 0.5, so get 50% of your max, and then finally by 0.2 to get 20% of your max. So you'll see in the next little clip how you should load the bar up with that. What you're gonna do is you're gonna have 90% on the bar, you're gonna lower the bar down a couple inches off your chest, you're gonna hold there for 10 seconds. After the 10 seconds is up, or if you fail before 10, obviously spot or rack the bar, you're gonna strip down at 50%. At, at 50%, you're gonna hold for 30 to 40 seconds, or if failure comes before 30. After that, you're gonna rack the bar again, and then you're gonna strip down to 20% of your max, and from there, you're gonna to try to hold for four minutes. All right, this is one, one set. There's no rest in between strips. Just however long it takes for you to strip that weight down, that's it. It's brutal. Uh, the following clips will kind of talk a little bit more about the best way to set your bar up. Say your max was 315, uh, 63 pounds. We're going to round that up to 65. That's 20%. So if there were 10 on there, that will be your 65. Then you're gonna go 50%, so 157.5 will make math easy, and the stripping of the weights easy, you're gonna go 155, so you're putting a plate on top of that. And then 90% is gonna be 283.5, so we're gonna round up on that one to 285, so then you're gonna have an extra plate there and an extra 210, obviously you're gonna slide all that weight in. Um, so you're gonna start, you're starting at 90, then you're going to quickly be able to just strip off the two tens and a 45, and then you'll be at your 50%. You'll do that hold, you'll strip off that next plate, and then you'll be left with just a 10 on each side for your 20% of 65. So the pauses on this style are a little different compared to your power lifter pause where you pause on the chest. For this style, you're going to pause a couple inches off your chest, so it would look like this. couple inches off the chest once the time expires rack the bar strip the weight down to the next percentage 